Hello there, my name is Richard Peck and I'm the creator of FixRedirectVirus.org. Um, if you've seen the website, you probably know already that it's a redirect virus removal tool. I just wanted to make this introduction really simple and quick and just to show you that we're an actual legitimate outfit and that we're not just going to kind of make some product that might not even work. As you can see here, this is the software box which we've created for our company, which is Frontline PC Utilities. And um, this is actually going on, on um, retail shops throughout the UK very soon. So, you know, obviously the product works. We're confident enough in the product to actually get it into the shops in the UK. And obviously, I want to show you now, number one, how to remove the virus. And number two, if you're interested, how to you know, use the program to remove the infection. So thanks for watching and obviously I'm going to help you right now. Welcome to FixRedirectVirus.org. In this video I want to explain exactly what the redirect virus is and how you can remove it from your PC in the most effective and reliable way possible. Now if you're on this page I can tell you now that the virus that you've got isn't a normal virus. It's one of the most difficult to remove and I found this out the hard way. My name is Richard and I run the Fix Redirect Virus website. and Basically, I created the site on the back of myself getting the infection on one of my PCs. Luckily for me, I'm a computer technician by trade, and I've got a lot of um, contacts, experience, and resources I can actually draw on to help fix these problems. And over the course of several months after getting the infection, I was able to repair, uh, completely repair the issue, and develop several different techniques to really get rid of the virus in the most complete way possible. Okay, so what is the Google Redirect Virus, or the Redirect Virus as it's commonly known? Uh, well, this virus is a browser hijack object, which is BHO, uh, or a Trojan horse. There are two variations. Um, many people just think there's one, just one Redirect Virus, but there's actually two different variations. The TDSS Trojan horse, and the just the generic Redirect Virus itself. Now. Both of these actually work in a very similar way, which is to basically change some settings or make a file on your PC that will um, change the way Windows handles redirects online. Now, the, one of the key things with this virus is most people see it when they go on the search engines or when they search Google, but it actually affects all redirections that your internet will handle. And what happens is, uh, when you browse the internet each day or whenever, uh, Windows will continually have to redirect uh, various pages online to different pages um, basically because websites either close down or change pages or whatever and so there's actually a setting inside Windows itself which handles the different uh, requests and where it takes you to the, the redirected page. What these viruses do, the redirect virus, is actually either change the settings that handle the, re the redirect or they will create a file which injects its own little link instead of um, the link that you get redirected to. So the bottom line is when you search Google or any other search engine, they actually take you to their own website, so google.com, and will then take you onto the next site that you need. So the redirect virus will just inject its own link into that uh, redirection and obviously you'll see the fake website that, or the advertisement that you're seeing right now. Um, so that's how the virus works uh, and unfortunately it's extremely difficult to remove because both variations of it are um, immune to antivirus programs. Antivirus programs basically look for either a rogue file or application on your PC and when they scan and look through your computer that's what they're looking for. Unfortunately, the, the redirect virus doesn't put um, a, a program or a file that most antivirus programs will actually identify. And this basically means that you can't use the likes of AVG, Norton, Trend Micro, any of the top antivirus programs you can't use with this virus. It's a, just a big problem that tons and tons of people are having. To remove the infection, you've got to delete the core of it. You've got to delete the files, um, the settings, or the the, the the options that are basically causing your computer to redirect and that's the tricky bit that most people don't know how to do. Fortunately I've worked out how to do it and I'm going to explain in this uh, in the coming slide exactly what to do so stay tuned. How to remove the redirect virus this is the, uh, the million dollar question that I'm sure thousands of people around the world will want to know. 
And the truth is that you've got to work smarter, not harder, to get rid of this virus. Most people will just think, oh, I've got to download a better antivirus or different anti-malware program or something like that. The fact is that none of those programs will actually work for this virus. Um, it's a big problem, and you know this is how to do it, deal with it. The way to get rid of it is to deal with the actual variant that's on your system. A variant of a virus is basically the type of virus that's out there. Um, I mean, many um, hackers and, and, and virus people right now will create about five or ten different variations of their infection just so that if one gets located, they've got the other other variants to rely on to, to do the dirty work for them. And although Google Redirect or the Redirect virus doesn't have um, ten infections or ten variations, it does have two, which I explained earlier is the TDSS Trojan horse or the generic virus, which I which I uh, have named, and that basically changes the settings on your system, uh, which deal with the redirects that, that the internet has and all that kind of stuff. So the bottom line is that antivirus and anti malware don't work to get rid of it. No matter which program you use, whether it's going to be something from PC Tools, Norton program, anti AVG, whatever, it, none of it works. Um, and I'm not doing this to scare I'm just explaining that it's not worth the time or effort or money in some cases to actually go out and get different software to deal with the infection. Now the way to actually get rid of it uh, is to basically work through the, the processes that are actually going to remove the variation that you have on your system. Now um, the way to do this is to basically uh, either work out which variant you have and then use the correct way to get rid of it or to go through the entire um, catalog of processes to remove the virus and with the hope that one of them will actually get the infection off your PC. Um, and it's the latter that I've just suggested which I recommend you use because that way you can actually ensure that your system is the most clean um, of all the types of the redirect virus you can get. The bottom line is you've got to find the central root of the virus which is either going to be a setting or some obscure file that no antivirus is going to find and then you've got to get rid of it. And that's exactly what I want to show you on this website. I'm going to show you exactly how to get rid of the virus.